Hey guys, what's up? It's Adam with Big Daddy Unlimited. Here today to give you uh, a little bit of an overview of what I take to the range. Some stuff that I find to be essential that you need to have, some stuff that may be nice to have, but don't necessarily need it. So what I'll do is I'll start with the bag. Uh, this is a Mystery Ranch Komodo Dragon. I kind of take this with me everywhere when I go shooting. It lives in my truck. And we'll start from top to bottom. And uh, I'll break it up into two different piles and then give you an overview of that. So top, first thing I have here, it's a notebook. I find a notebook to be really good, especially with training and practice, because it allows me to stick to a regiment or a plan. Um, prior planning for a range trip always equals success. Usually the night before for about 30 minutes, I'll sit down, take my notebook, and I'll jot down a list of what I need to accomplish. I also try to maximize my time so I don't shove as much garbage as I can in that time allotted. I'd rather spend more time on a singular thing to perfect it instead of just trying to cram a bunch of stuff and half-assing everything. I know you can't swear, but that's the thing. Next item up is a wind meter. Uh, you can use a Kestrel. These are from Geo Ballistic. I really like it. It actually integrates into my cell phone for my ballistic apps, which brings me to the next thing, cell phone. Uh, again, creating lists, checking velocities, uh, reading your ballistic data can all be done because of modern technology. So we'll set that to this side that's done with this pocket. The next one down in here, I have magazines. Uh, generally, I don't take more than two guns to the range. So in here, you'll find two Magpul mags for bolt guns. I'll have two magazines, both a short and a long magazine. So a 20 and a 30 rounder uh, for gas gun, because I do have to take my AR out later and actually get some zero and some velocity data. So those, they'll go over there. Uh, this is kind of an extra, but it's an arm board. I use it for data uh, when I shoot matches. We'll throw that over there. Going into the main pack, uh, the main compartment of the pack. Uh, next, rain jacket. Uh, it's an Arteris jacket. Living here in Florida, we can get rainstorms at a minute's notice. This I find to be a necessity regardless if I use it or not. I always have it, so we'll throw that up there. Take a pair of knee pads. Uh, if I end up shooting positional stuff or if I need to work on things, a set of knee pads always nice to have. Shooting mat, this will fold out. So whether you're laying on mud, dirt, concrete, shooting mat will keep you protected from those elements. Also allows you to keep your brass and everything in one area. Um, it's a Coltac mat, super good. Next up. Two forms of hearing protection. Always recommend a silencer. Everybody should have one. I'm a huge proponent of shooting suppressors on rifles and handguns. They offer you a lot of benefit. And then a great set of hearing protection. Uh, you only get one set of eyes, one set of ears. So hearing protection is a huge must. I don't have them on me now, but for eye protection, I always use my Oakley sunglasses or Oakley shooting glasses. So those are both go up here. One thing I will never, ever forget, because I've done it in the past, is a rear bag. Rear bags are great. They're, you can use them for a multitude of different things, whether you're using them for support for the stock, throwing them on top of a barricade, a rear bag, super, super essential. Uh, don't necessarily need it, but a brass bag, uh, I reload, so I always keep it here. If you buy some of the fancy brass from us and you do reload, it's a great way to manage it. Keep it all in one place, has a cinch top so it doesn't fall out. And then last but not least, ammunition. So I use the DACA pouches from Magpul. These are great because they allow me to separate it. The small one uh, generally will have 5.56. The large one will have 6.5 Creedmoor. So those are, uh, those are really nice. They make everything really simple. They're flexible, weather resistant. So if it rains, ammo doesn't get wet. So that is my actual range pack kind of broken out. Uh, some other things that aren't in this pack but I always have with me is a tool bag. In here you'll find uh, masking tape, Allen wrenches, oil, uh, barrel swabs. Uh, what else do we got in this thing? All kinds of craziness. I've got spare firing pins for a bolt gun. Uh, one tool that I kind of never leave anywhere, I've got a couple of them, is a multitasker. Uh, it's a great multi-tool. You can use it for anything, whether you're working on an AR-15 or a bolt gun or an optic. These things are pretty valuable. 
Uh, other than that, miscellaneous wrenches and kind of everything that just sits in this bag. Uh, it's an Armageddon gear bag, so I'm gonna throw that over to this side because it's, it's a have to have. The last piece that I always bring with me, and this is a me thing, this may not be a you thing, is a magneto speed. Uh, shooting precision rifle, uh, shooting any rifle really, velocity means a lot. You can extrapolate a lot of data just by knowing the speed of your projectiles. Um, anytime I go to the range, if I'm doing a practice session, load development, I always got it with me. Um, it's just nice to know. It's good data. You may or may not need it. I deem it as I need it. So if you look on the table, I've got kind of two different piles. This is my support gear. These are the kind of nice to have, but you don't need it. This is my action gear. Action gear is I got to have it to shoot. If I'm going to get any kind of good training time, whether I'm shooting carbines, bolt action, pistols, I'll always have this stuff just as a default. Um, you can't go wrong with it. It's all good gear. Good gear will get you home and it'll last. You buy once, you cry once, and you never have to worry about it again. Uh, if you have any questions about anything or you, you want some information, feel free to give us a call or shoot us an email and check us out at Big Daddy Unlimited.